Christine Havis. I'm director of the School of Art at Kent State University, and we're here at the Margaret Clark Morgan Foundation to look at a, work, a show of works by our graduate students who are working toward their MFA, which is a terminal degree in the visual arts. If you look around, you'll see works in different media, and I'm very struck by the range here. Um, we have quite the range within the school. In fact, we have the broadest array in this part of the state of different arts disciplines. So that includes painting and sculpture and printmaking, photography, ceramics, glass, textiles, jewelry metals, say glass, <laughs> and drawing. So quite a bit and I was very struck the way that our graduate students seem to cross media very readily and that's been typical of graduate students always. Um, one of the and then you'll see other things that are a little more representational and things which are more abstract, things which are about the concepts of counting and weaving, uh, things that are about more um, about color and the abstract things that artists have explored for quite some time. So this really represents quite a range and we're very pleased to be able to share this work here in Hudson with the members of the Hudson community and invite people to come and join us and take a good look at what's being made in one of the more important MFA programs in the country. Uh, my name is Angela Biederman and the pieces are named Chunk Study 1 and Chunk Study 2. Uh, they're made out of ceramic and they're mostly an exploration in technique. Um, I was working in the studio and just trying to explore different methods and just trying to like loosen up with working so I took blocks of clay essentially and stacked them and made different forms and then worked intuitively and using additive and reductive methods to come up with the forms and these are the two that I came up with. This is fired in a wood kiln and so wood is used entirely for the fuel source and the ash is what places the piece, the ash and the flame. And then this was fired in a gas kiln, so you use a, a glaze, and that's what gives it the difference. I'm Laura Gutierrez, I'm a graduate student at Kent State. I have a Bachelor of Fine Art degree from the Institute of Art and Illustration, and so I decided to get my Master's at Kent and go into painting. <laughs> More about finding my own voice. So I've been experimenting with abstract art. Yeah, and this piece is called Seascape One. It's made out of plexiglass with uh, various uh, mixed media, plastic bottles, um, plastic pieces of resin, uh, pieces of metal and stuff. And my work is about our relationship with our environment. It's about our relationship with nature, with footprints we've left on, um, what does it say about us as a culture, about our society, where we've been, and also um, questions about where we're going from here. So. My name is Nicolin Haynes, and I'm a ceramics graduate student attending Kent State University. And my work here is a combination of wheel-thrown closed forms that I then later attach together and um, apply different kinds of surface decoration. Um, these two pieces happen to be wood-fired as well, so you get a variety of different um, surface qualities from rough to smooth to really shiny and really dull and cracky. This work for me and what I've been continuing to work on primarily around uh, symbiotic relationships, interactions between different species and different organisms, and really playing around with this idea of the push, the push and pull um, between, you know, is this, is this a good relationship or is this a negative or a bad relationship?